two ethnic groups in, in West Africa, in, around Nigeria and, and, and Ghana. And actually, a lot of us have descended from those tribes, as we know now. I don't see no solidarity there. I know some of y'all, some of us try to go back and claim and, and reclaim names that we that our ancestors lost in slavery, but where's the solidarity? There is none. So how can you really call yourself an African? How can you say you, can you say you call yourself African American? Man, to me, you ain't when you ain't when you ain't showing no solidarity with the Africans in, in Africa, then you ain't you nothing but a damn American to me. I'm sorry. That's what I'm gonna see you as an American. And then and you ain't fooling the Africans either, cause they know that too. Y'all over here talking to yourself, you saying you're Africans, but yet they they look at us and say, man, look at the culture. You following the, you following Americans uh, American um values. I'm not following no African values, you're following American values. It's two thousand it's twenty first century. They looking at it like, wait, wait a second, y'all not we ain't slaves anymore. Y'all ain't slaves anymore. Why you can't learn the African language? They, that's how they look at us, like, huh? What? African what? You what? They, come on. It takes more to be an African than being black. I keep telling people that. Africa is a country is a continent. It's all it is with different cultures and different and different languages and different uh, countries. And you just can't say, oh, because my ancestors came from Africa, I'm going to call myself African. No, it don't work like that. It don't work like that. You got to start learning the culture and you got to start showing solidarity. And I don't see black people in America showing solidarity when it comes to those in Africa. That's why I, I be like, we ain't no damn African-American. That's why I be saying that. Because we don't try to follow none of the stuff they do over there. We don't try to follow none of the cultures, none of that stuff. How, how can I? How can I sit back and say and say I'm African American and, and, and we and we and I'm not, we're not even following it? We sitting out here following American values and American rules and all this stuff and talking English and not even trying to learn African language. We come to learn learning English. People fucking trying to debate me online about this and they and they they talk about it and they speaking in English. Like you, how are you going to debate, debate me on that when you speaking to me in English? Don't want to hear it. Don't want to hear it. You ain't fooling them. And I know that Nigerians and all of them are gone, and, and, and they speak English too, but we, but they still got their own languages over there. We have opportunity to learn a language, uh, a language from that that part of the of, of the continent. And we ain't even trying. But yeah, you want to sit back and try to bait, try to bait people about about why we should call ourselves African American when you're not even showing solidarity to none of the African countries that are going through disarray right now. I mean, Somalia was going through some crazy shit. Yeah, genocide all over the place. I ain't seen not one fucking black person in America put up, and I know that those are East Africans. I understand that. But the bottom line is, you call yourself African American, so you'll think, I'll, you'll think you will show some Somalian flags on your fucking on your fucking profile. There was none, and Ash Hawkins can, he knows that. There was none. And Ebola, when the Ebola, when the, when the Ebola happened in West Africa, which is which is technically our ancestors' homeland, uh, home home uh, on uh, homeland. So that's where most of the slaves came from. Where was the where was the Nigerian flag? Where was where was the Ghana, the Ghana flag and and, and 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 the Ivory Coast flag? Where was where was all that? Where was that? Oh, what, oh, oh, better yet, where was the Liberian flag? Because you know a lot of Liberia was built by black by black Americans who wanted to go to Africa and where their ancestors came from and build and, and start and start over. After slavery, after, after they was free from slaves, from being from being slaves, what was that flag? All that stuff was happening over there. Well, none, none. That even shows. That even shows solidarity with the South Africans. I ain't see the South Africans. They still going through crap right now. Even though Mr. Mandela, even though Mr. Mandela, Mandela helped it, helped help the situation out by ending up trying to end by helping apartheid in. They still going to crap back down there. Where, where's the, where's the South African flag on your on your thing? On your Facebook profile? Where where is it? 
Matter of fact, what happened to the the, the what happened to the the, the, the so called African flag? Which is the flag of uh, um, 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 green, red, and black. What happened to that? When the African country go down in some kind of turmoil, what? what why you didn't put that flag on, on your Facebook profile? Quit the nonsense. To me, I, like I said before, it's like you only want to call yourself that because it, sound, cause, cause, cause it, it sounds good. It's like you only want to call yourself African American because it, 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 you can have an identity and you won't have an identity crisis, and that's all. Cause you still see people calling themselves Puerto Rican and, 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 and Dominican, which they ain't if they born in America. So you say, oh, well, they know where they came from. They, they, they still proud of it. So I'm going to call myself African American. Man, listen, the difference between us and, and people who call themselves Puerto Rican, and, and even though they're born in America, is that they still go by Puerto Rican culture. They still eat. I'm not saying that they eat rice and beans. That's all they eat. But the thing, you understand what I'm talking about. That's the difference. And they only like two. They only like between two to five generations strong. So that that means that the people who born in the, the people that are Puerto Rican descent that's born in America have family that's, that 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 still live in Puerto Rico. That's the difference. And they know about them. The same thing with Italy. There's only five generations. Some of the, some of the Italian some people that are Italian descent in America is only like fucking five generations strong. So they know our family in in in, in, in Italy. Come on. That's the difference. We've been over here for 500 years. We don't, we don't even know nobody over there in, in like that in, in, in West Africa. But we can learn. But, none of, but we ain't trying to learn that. But we, what we want to debate me and debate other people why we, why we, shouldn't, why we, call, why we should call African-American. When you ain't, I've said, yo, it's, like I said, the reason why I don't like the, the term because I feel like we need to, it's more to being African than just being black. I keep telling people that. That's why I said, man, I'm not going to call myself that. I don't know no, no language, no culture, no nothing over there. Until I learn it, I'm not call, I'm calling myself a black man in America. It's that simple. And this right here showed me right now why we should, we, 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 why I don't like the term. Because we're not we ain't doing no solidarity with Africans. We're not. But we're but we quick to do it with the French. And please don't try to tell me because there's black people in France right now. I don't want to hear that crap. I don't want. I don't want to hear it. Got no sense. Be like, well, you know, it's black people that live in France. Yeah, and they they, they not from America either. They came from Africa. So please stop the nonsense. If you really want to call yourself an African, you gotta go show some solidarity with Africans and go learn some cultures over there. Stop cut the bull crap. Cause the only thing you're doing anyway is making it look like immigrants in the first place. And I'm an immigrant. I was born in America. It's that simple. It's okay to have the to 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 want to to, to wanna, wanna, wanna be proud of your, your your roots. It's all good. You want to call your African roots. There's no problem with that. No problem with one, you know. But don't don't sit up here and talk about you 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 an African and you ain't and you ain't even showing solidarity with the African with the African nations. I don't want to hear it. But when they go to turmoil, I don't want to hear it. Last time I remember people going uh, um looking out for Africa. I'll tell you the truth, uh, who was black people? Was these three guys: Lionel Richie, Michael Jackson, and Quincy Jones. That was the only. That was the last time I, I seen black people try to try to do something for Africa by writing by doing a song called "We All the World." That was the last time that I know about. Please cut the crap. I'm tired of y'all motherfuckers. I'm really tired of y'all. This got be this got be mad because I'm saying up here saying myself. Damn, people want, want to debate about this, about the term African American, but yet nobody is even trying to fucking show solidarity with any Africans. And you got, and, but they quick to fucking try to learn, try try to try to try to show solidarity with with with, a friend, with, 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 with France, who are known in the past to colonize black people. Let me get off this shit because um this this is 
yo, let's go back to some music, man. You understand what I'm saying, Ash Hawkins? These people, these black people in America are so ignorant, it's not even funny, man. I'm tired. Let's go back to some music. Real Vision Radio. Try to stop me, then I'm popping, ain't no stopping me Fucking with the bundle and the motherfucking hollow queen Now you ducked off with, nobody can hear you scream If you owe me money, better get it, do you copy me? For your life, no bargains, have your brains laid sloppily We'll start to finish like a signature, you know it's me The man in the mirror is the only nigga seeing me All you fake fuckers, good luck, trying to mock a GM A prototype, your carbon copy, all you do is follow me In this game of life, there's no way you can take the lead of my own man, got my own man. And that's just a simple thing, stay low key, but I'm profiting by all means. Graveyard shit, making music while you proud on me. Niggas wanna do it, but they know I keep that thing on me. Gotta make a dollar, so I'm protecting the triple B. I need that, gotta have that. I'm going after that. If I want that, I'ma take that I'm going hard off the bat What the fuck y'all think this is? Some type of game, I snap your neck I don't like new people Especially around my money And you can think again If you thought of taking from me And getting in my way will be your last mistake I don't got no more gold passes You hoes ain't catching no more breaks I'm tired Yeah, I move too quick I'm gonna get it how I live Even if I start from scratch Bitch, you ain't reaching where I'm at I'm getting it I was born a hustler I take good care of myself And depend on no one else I'ma go get in nothing less trust Welcome to the court Can you handle the next level? Enter in my zone At your own risk Chance your residence Being changed to one Dug with a shovel Fuck you, I'm going for what I want And I'ma stay steps above you I need that, gotta have that I'm going after that Now she geek, now she geek She done brought one of her friends Now she freak, 